So what's going to happen with this situation with Putin and Russia and Ukraine? This is the final battle. And today we're going to be discussing the Ukraine situation, the war in Ukraine. This is what was Titus, this is what it's up to now. If Putin kill Zelensky, Putin calls World War Three. So the best thing Putin and Russia can do is just ease down because uh Zelensky won the world support. Everybody loves Zelensky and everybody like what he's doing because any other president in this situation would have fled. They would have went into exile. They'd be in another country hiding. And <laughs> believe it or not, Russia would still be after him. But uh, Zelensky stand there to the death. Him and his um, him and his people, they stand there to the death. So that's why that's what made uh, Zelensky a more powerful person than Putin and all his might. Secondly, in this situation now, the Soviets, I'm saying the Soviets, the Russians are losing. They're running out of gas. They're running out of food. They're running out of artillery. And um, basically, they're trying to surround Kiev. You understand what I mean? They're trying to surround their targets. They're not really trying to infiltrate. So a lot of people is uh, confusion was going on. And because a lot of people from the East Coast, you know what I mean, is looking at the regular news, so they just seeing the uh, one-sided perspective of the war. But if you're really looking at it and you really know what's going on, the um, Russians are basically trying to create a, a borderline. They're trying to surround a Pacific area, Pacific areas before they assaulted. So they're doing the shelling and stuff like that to intimidate them and force them out. But um, technically, they're not running no operations to overthrow them yet, just as of yet. But uh, I'll tell you this. If Putin kills Zelensky, the world will not forgive Putin or Russia. This will be World War Three, And I don't know why Putin acting all badass. Putin and Russia will get their asses kicked. They're not as tough as they seem and as they uh, try to post up to be and as everybody respect them as. They just the king of bluffing. Russia will get its ass kicked by NATO, by the United States, by any, even Germany will give uh, Russia pro a problem. The only thing Russia can do is try to, uh, so technically... If Zelensky die, it will be World War Three, And I'm telling you, Russia will get his ass kicked. The big bad fear of Russia is only um, basically hype up, hyped up um, America propaganda for political gain. And um, do, is Russia dangerous? Yes, Russia is dangerous. They have a nuclear arsenal. They have nuclear submarines. They have the... Uh, Second most largest army in the world. But uh, they don't have, they can't even even uh, try to even deal with NATO. They won't even last a minute. I mean, like, it'll be the quickest war in history. And um, the reason why this bad is because the Russian people, now, the people that live in Russia is now international people, you know what I'm saying? And the problem is, Putin got, you know what I mean? He he got hate from the Cold War. He got hate going all the way back to when, you know, the Soviet Union was uh, broken up and all of these uh, places split up and went their own direction, you know? So... That's what bothers Putin, and that's the why Putin is dangerous because he got an old mentality and an old grudge. You understand what I mean? And he hate NATO to death, but it's nothing he can do about NATO. You understand what I mean? But uh, Putin been buckling up to China, keeping cool with Syria and Iran. So, you know, but even those forces combined is no match for NATO.
There is not no match for NATO. Not even close. So the ultimate question is, can we avoid World War Three? And it's only all up to Putin to not kill Zelensky. If Putin killed the president of Ukraine, right? The whole entire world would turn on Russia and Putin. Even the Russian people would turn on Putin. But Putin is in a terrible situation if he let Zelensky live. If he let him live, he got... You, you, you talking about the possible new president of Russia, <laughs> Zelensky, because the Russian people going to love him. So Putin done created a massive problem for himself. And it's no win game for Putin at the end of this. At the end of this, Putin is going to lose, 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 lose. It's no winning. And that's what makes this dangerous because if Putin is losing, Putin will push that button. Putin don't give a fuck about nothing. This is the final battle.